Okay, problem number six. Binomial probability distribution. Uh, something similar you should expect on the uh, midterm exam. Okay, so in this case uh, we have um, a poll which su suggested that 55% uh, of Canadians support uh, the legalization of uh, marijuana. If uh, 20 Canadians are randomly surveyed, uh, find the probability that uh, at most 10 support marijuana's legalization. Okay. Okay, so in this case we have a fixed number of trials, yeah, so we are asking 20 Canadians. Uh, trials are independent, yeah, so the opinion of one uh, person does not affect uh, the opinion of the other person. Each uh, trial must have all outcomes uh, classified into categories, so that's what we have in this case. Uh, they support or they do not support. And the probability of a success remains the same in all trials, uh, and uh, it is the case, uh, and it is equal to 0 0.55. Okay, you need to be really careful with the wording in, 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 this, um, in this type of problems. Uh, at most 10 means uh, 10 and less. Yeah, and this is perfect uh, for our uh, binomial distribution formula. Uh, number of uh, successes is uh, 10 then uh, trials 20 probability of uh, success is uh, 0 0.55 and this is cumulative so it calculates uh, all probabilities uh, to the left uh, from uh, from x so which is in this case is uh, 10 so it's going to calculate probability uh, for 10, for 9, for 8, for 7, and so on and so forth, like, and add all those probabilities up, okay? Perfect. Um, at least 10. So, at least 10. At least uh, uh, 10, so that means uh, uh, that's um, uh, 10 and more. So, 10 and so in this case we can just uh, take uh, one yeah, and uh, subtract all the probabilities uh, from 9 and uh, to the left. So then we are going to be left with 10 and everything like to the, to the right. Okay, so number of uh, successes is 9 trials is uh, 20 probability of uh, success uh, is uh, 0 0.55 and that's cumulative okay so at least 10 probability the probability is uh, 0 0.75 okay in between 7 and 10 yeah in between 7 and 10 so in this case we need to take uh, if you want like to include 7 and 10 so we need to to take binomial uh, distribution from 10 and uh, to the uh, left and then subtract from 6 and to the left so then we are going to be left with uh, uh, 7 to 10 okay including 7 and including 10 okay so this is uh, 10 number of trials is 20 probability of success is 0 0.55 uh, and it is uh, cumulative and then minus uh, binomial uh, distribution and then here we have uh, six number of trials is 20 probability of success is 0 0.55 and it is cumulative okay so that's it that's it so something similar so something similar you should expect on the uh, midterm exam and as I said be careful with the uh, wording uh, read problem carefully so it is extremely important in this uh, case okay okay so that's it uh, for problem number six and let's move to the last three problems